Hello there, Digifreaks. You know who this is? Well, you're you better. You it's Impmon. And I'm continuing Knack. I mean, not Knack, Ratchet and Clank. Ugh. Okay, I better not get caught in the corner. I don't know what happened last time. Jump. I'm gonna rip you apart. Sprocket by sprocket. Water. Ah! Yeah. Again, like I said in the previous video. Okay, while I was rudely interrupted, or cut off during the footage, what I was trying to say when it comes to the movie clip, it will stop the recording, so I'll put in the link in the description down below. So, and here's the flaw about the movie I talked I was gonna talk about. When it came to Ratchet and Clank, they just instantly become friends. It didn't really took much of a process, like the 2000 counterpart. It just happened in an instant. Ugh. Large gaps where child's play to Ratchet. Mm -hmm. All you would need to get across is a trusty swing shot and a little bravado. I don't even know what that is. For a, hero, a conveniently placed crate provided Ratchet with a combustor. Nice! A combustor! Hmm. Ratchet basked in the freedom of being able to switch weapons whenever he felt like it. This thing doesn't even have much ammo. Impressive shooting. I don't know why was I have trouble aiming. Okay, I'm trying to remember the controlling. So to throw the Omni wrench, just do this. Press the square button, not the trigger. But when it comes to the guns, I just press triangle to equip it and then use it. to your planet so he could get it back Ratchet had to think fast perhaps the hook shot would solve his current conundrum oh geez listen to me I want you to lock the garage doors and then head down into the shelter I'll be there as soon as I can Confused and alone, he scoured the Kizzle Plateau for signs of ne- I think that's all of them. Oh, jeez. Also known as the dropship of death. Great. Every single bullet counts. Bada boom!
Okay, good thing I didn't fall off. All the jobs just been given us. We gotta look for some defect. Ah, uh, it's not that bad. We've got clean air, four feet of the sun. This is nature. We never had any of this back on the <laughs> What? What happened? I just got bit by a mosquito. Did you see the size of that thing? Ah, uh, nature's vampires. Had to deal with those things before. Well, I didn't know what I thought that would work. Order all over Grim's garage. Grim, are you okay? Just hold tight, Grim. I got this. Grenade! Oh jeez. Yeah. Okay, that was a miss of fire. Ah. Mm. I'll show you. Oh jeez. Good to meet a fellow academic. Really, I just look at the pictures and then, you know, wing it. So what? It was he planning to move out? Pretty sure people nowadays don't really do that. But, oh, well, who knows? Okay. Come on! There. That takes care of them. Can you open up? That Grim, listen, get my tools ready. I just found something in the desert I need to look at. Interesting. What kind of factory is this? This? No, oh, this is just a garage. Lived here since I was a kid. Come on, let's get you fixed up. Oh, come on. Okay, no, never mind. Just corporations being greedy. Or whatever, and I need that stupid capture card or whatever people end up saying. Well, it's damaged, but I'm <sighs> Come on, maybe there's someone in town who can help us. I am really sick and tired of these corporations and their stupid. Wait a second, is that raritanium? Maybe we should upgrade our weapons first. Again, this is seriously getting pretty annoying. Just really, why? Why does it do that? Ugh. Okay. There'll be some cutscene. There'll most likely be some cutscenes cut being recorded. Others don't. So. I'm not making any promises. If it does, it ha if it happens, it happens. And have to do some timestamps or whatever. Torture, torture, real? Is there? All you gotta do is pick one of them cells. Are these things chained together. Go ahead and fill out the whole chain. 
All right, just confirm the transaction and the deal's done. Hey, you surrounded a mystery cluster. Now that's gonna give you a big boost. That's all there is to it. Give it a spin on one of your own. I'm gonna save some. Ugh, again. I really hope in other games, when it comes to cutscenes, we won't have that issue. If it does, then I have no idea, and later on, I'll consider getting that stupid capture card as most people tend to require to. Ugh. Delves the depths of uh, deepness. Uh, again, some it records, some cuts in spin will be recorded, some will don't due to the screen shit, screen record thing. Because I don't know how to, most people do it. But it's seriously, I have no idea what's going on, so there'll be some recorded, some don't. So I'm just assuming, yes, in in-game animation. They appear to be amoeboids. According to my databanks, they were created by Threat Industries in order to assist the warbots. Okay, like I said, there'll be some cutscenes that will be recorded, some won't. So I'm gonna assume if it's just the cinematic cutscenes itself within the game, but if the cinematic cutscenes are with the movie clip, it will not be recorded and it will stop there for some reason. I really don't understand these corporations choosing the right time of when to pause and when not to pause. Like it's seriously making me Pretty upset right now. Oh, whatever. Okay, I'm having a feeling they're gonna do that with, you know, the next game I might get once I get the PlayStation 5. But I really hope not. They keep coming. Ah, those stupid stretchy arms. Okay, forget it. said the same thing. Okay, I didn't get stuck. This must be the way out. Hey, you looking for some weapons? I'm all full. Nah. Not yet. Some. Come and buy a Pyrocitor! 
Launch. Platforming games. Hang on. Uh. Combusta. Gotta steady my aim. Come on. Oops, didn't mean to fall he fall here. Touch the old deja vu. Uh, I don't think so. Again, I really hope it's recording this. If not, then again, I'll put in a link in the description. But I remember the plumber. He's the exact same character who predicts the future or whatever. He always gives out information of this will definitely it might get a sequel. Oh, the plan is to make a sequel like most of his games. Oh, hello there. I'm Alonzo Drek, chairman of Drek Industries. Many of you may be wondering, why are 300 heavily armed warbots marching ominously towards a Class G Dread ship? <laughs> the answer is simple, friends. Progress. Years ago, we were driven underground by pollution that may or may not but most definitely was caused by my father's company. Since then, we've shifted focus from robotics to planet building. Now that our project is nearing completion, we must do everything possible to stay on schedule. In this case, it means our friendly army of warbots must vanquish those who would seek to stop us. Good news, they don't know we're coming. So sit back, relax, and take comfort in the knowledge that Drek Industries is working for you. Drek Industries is not working for you. 
Is that even possible? To, like, build a planet out of all their planet parts? Did that guy just slide down a sewer pipe? Hmm. Well, it does look like the fastest way down. Let's give it a shot. Okay, I think this is where they kept the recording. But we're kind of running out of time here. So, if you like what you see, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And share with your friends if you like. See you in the next video.